Hi guys, I'm Simon from Ridge Monkey and we're here today on the windswept banks of Drayton Reservoir. We're going to cook you up a couple of uh, lovely little meals. Uh, first off, we've got some pan fried pollock with a little tomato poi lentils and some asparagus. So let's get started. So as you can see, the pans are there, they're already on, they're getting nice and warm. Uh, I'm just going to use a small bit of spray oil. Right, so we've just got the oil in the pan there. While that's just coming up to temperature, I've got this little bag that I picked up from the uh, supermarket yesterday. Now it's ready cooked pouillon green lentils and they're in a little tomato sauce. So that's going to be really a, a great accompaniment to go with the fish. So we're just going to empty this into the, uh, the second section of the pan. Right, so that oil's now coming up to temperature. It's just starting to steam a little bit. So what we're gonna do, I've got some pollock fillets here. Lovely sustainable fish. And all I've done is I've just dusted those in a little bit of salt, pink rock salt, some uh, black pepper, and then some um, garlic. Right guys, so the lentils are warming through lovely. The fish is nearly there. We've just got to flip it over in a second. Now I haven't got the heat on too high. I don't want to burn that fish. I just want it to nicely caramelize with that salt, that garlic and that pepper on there. But just to finish it off, the last bit that we're going to do is just add the asparagus to the pan. And that's just going to, a little bit of oil over the top. And then once again, a little bit of salt and we're just going to let that cook through nicely. Right guys, so you can see from here, the asparagus is now cooking through that fish. It's cooked all the way through just by having it on one side. So what we're going to do is just flip it over ever so lightly. And there you go, we've got a nice bit of colour and a nice little crust on there, but it's not overcooked and that fish isn't going to be chewy and tough. So all that's left to do now really, is just plate up. So we're just going to move these stoves out of the way. Bring the plate into the centre. Now the first onto the plate we're going to use are these lentils. Now don't forget, as I said, these are tomato lentils. So they, they've already got all the flavour, the herbs, the seasoning, etc. in them straight from the packet. So it's a really convenient way of, uh, of carrying food with you. In the same way that you can get the rice that's ready cooked in the little packets, you can keep all of these, they do many different types. So lentils are on. Asparagus onto there next, and then we'll just finish with the pollock. And there we have it guys, pollock with tomato poi lentils and asparagus. Now one other way that you could do this, if you've already got a combi pan, you can do it in a combi pan as well, rather than the, uh, the XL Toasty that we've just used. If you've got the new steamer tray, you could even steam the fish rather than pan frying it. So you're steaming the fish and you're steaming the uh, asparagus there, while the lentils are just cooking in the larger compartment underneath, a bit of water in the smaller compartments just to cook that fish through. But that is a stunning little meal to eat on the bank.